Doug Cass is with us. He's with Seabreeze Partners. Doug, I'm looking at big profit gains that are going to be reported very soon. 15%, 17%. Surely that's good for my 401k, isn't it? It's good for the market, but there are other issues that the market's concerned with. Uh, to borrow words from one of your countrymen, Aldous Huxley, we live in a fang new world. Um, I believe that we're arguably in a new regime of heightened volatility and compressed market multiples. If you think about it, 2017 was a year of hope in which valuations expanded. The S&P price earnings multiple rose by over two points. 2018, by contrast, is probably the year of reality in which uh, multiples are compressed vis-a-vis -vis 2017. So, let me get this straight. Even if profits go up very significantly, I know we're told 15, 17, maybe 20 percent. Let's suppose we do that. You're still telling me that this market does not go up some more, doesn't hit new highs above 26, 27,000. That is correct. First level thinking is corporate profits are higher, so the stock market must rise. But second level thinking, which really works in the stock market most of the time, is that corporate profits are rising and it's been fully discounted in the marketplace. You do not like big tech. Spell it out. Why not? Well, I, I do not like big tech. Big tech. Uh, you've been talking about Patrick Reed in sports. I will give you a, a baseball <laughs> analog. Um, to me, Fang um, just completed the first inning of a baseball game. The share price uh, of uh, Facebook, Amazon, Netflix, and Google, the acronym for Fang, uh, rose astronomically. Um, their technological innovation and advances were very impressive. Uh, but they were in the batter's box against a bunch of Class A baseball pitchers. In real life, my cousin is Sandy Koufax. Uh, the Hall of Fame and uh, baseball pitcher from the, Los from the Brooklyn Dodgers and probably the greatest left-hand pitcher in history. He's coming on the mound. Uh, Donald Trump, our president, has basically issued a sell recommendation on Amazon and reduced its price target. And I think all four members of the FANG should be avoided or shorted. Okay. I do hear you, Doug. Is Sandy Koufax your cousin? Yes, he is. I'm really? a Koufax. Really? Uh, okay, well, well wow. I, I didn't know that, I did, but you can be back on the show regardless. <laughs> um, I'm sorry you don't like the fangs. I'm sorry you don't think the market's going up anymore. Uh, but look, thanks for being with us on a Monday morning. Don't be a wet blanket Thank on you, us. You know, we, we accept your valid analysis. <laughs> we got that, okay? You got it. Thanks very much, Doug. We'll see you again soon.